Hello everybody, welcome to Catch Game. Today video, I'm going to show you how to fix variant DirectX 11 error or DX11 feature level 10 is required to run the engine. So until now, you can fix this error just for this video and please go ahead and drop a like on this video and also please subscribe my channel. Let's get started. Okay guys, first of all, before doing any method, just go and check out your DirectX version. And to check out your DirectX version, right click on start menu and then click on run. And now just enter DXDIAG and uh, just enter this comment and then click on run. Click on OK. And uh, now just uh, go to the uh, DirectX diagnostic tool and uh, go down and check out your DirectX version under here. And as you can see, I have a DirectX 12 on my laptop. And then uh, just go to the top bar and click on display tab. And uh, just go to the here and check out your feature levels. And also go down and check out your DirectX features. And make sure to all of the DirectX features are enabled. And then just go and uh, close up DirectX uh, diagnostic tool. And now guys, for the first method, just go and open up your web browser and download DirectX 11. Uh, first of all, just go to the Microsoft website. I put the link of this website on my description. So just go and check out my description. And then scoot down and click on download. And then just uh, download DirectX setup. And then um, just click on uh, DirectX setup on here. And now just go and check this option. Then click on next. Now click on next again. And then just wait for a few seconds. And uh, as you can see, guys, uh, it's done uh, for the first method. Just go and download DirectX 11. But if it didn't work, uh, you should just go and uh, update your graphic card driver and also your Windows. To update your Windows, uh, just go down and type uh, check for updates on here and then open up check for updates. And now you can update your uh, Windows to the latest version from here. And sometimes this error comes up because of your graphic card driver. And if you have an NVIDIA graphic card on your laptop or on your PC, just go and download GeForce Experience. And then you can update your graphic card driver to the latest version from GeForce Experience. And also if you have an AMD or Intel graphic card on your PC, just go and search on your web browser and update your graphic card driver to the latest version. And it's the second method you can do to fix this problem. Just go and update your Windows and also your graphic card driver. But if it didn't work, you should just go and use your dedicated graphic card to play Valorant. If you have an integrated and also dedicated graphic card on your PC, just go and switch your graphic card to dedicated. And uh, when you disguise, you can get more FPS and sometimes it's helps you to fix this error code. And to switch your graphic card to dedicated, you should just go and uh, right click on your um, this PC. Just right click on it and then just go down and go to the properties. And um, then just go to the device uh, manager under here. And now just go and uh, click on uh, display adapters. And now just go and select your integrated uh, graphic card, CPU integrated graphic card. Right click on it and uh, click on disable device. And then guys, uh, you will get black screen on your monitor or on a laptop. And as usual, so don't worry. And after a few seconds, uh, your screen pops up. And um, so just go and disable your uh, integrated graphic card. If you have an integrated uh, graphic card, CPU integrated graphic card, just go to the here, right click on it, and click on disable device. And is the last method I know to fix this error code. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching video. I hope this will help you to fix this problem. Please go and reply on this video, and also please subscribe my channel. Peace out.